Ah, nothing beats the aroma of freshly brewed coffee at this late hour, eh? Just as I was about to call it a night, a piece of cyber news caught my eye. Now, before we dive into this tale, do me a favor, will you? Hit that like and subscribe button below. It helps an old man keep sharing stories with you. So, there I was, sipping my dark roast, when I stumbled upon the latest antics of the Lockbit ransomware group. These folks have been busy bees, working on something they call Lockbit 4.0. Now, for those of you not in the know, this isn't their first rodeo. Lockbit has been around the block, causing all sorts of mayhem. But this new version, 4.0, they say it's supposed to be the bee's knees, the cream of the crop in the ransomware world. They've been adding all sorts of bells and whistles, making it tougher for the good guys to catch them. Now, here's where it gets interesting. There's this character, goes by the name Lockbit Sup. Word on the street, or should I say, word on the internet, is that this fella has been engaging with law enforcement. Engaging, they say. Now, I've seen my share of crime dramas to know that engaging can mean a whole lot of things. Is Lockbit Sup trying to get a clean slate, start afresh away from his dark dealings, or is he bargaining? hoping to cut down his sentence. The suspense is killing me, but those law enforcement folks, they're keeping their cards close to their chest. Not a word on what this engagement entails. It's like watching a thriller, but the next episode hasn't been released yet. This whole scenario, it's a real cat and mouse game between the cyber crooks and the law. You've got to hand it to these lockbit characters. They're always one step ahead, or so they think. Developing a new ransomware version while supposedly chatting up the law? It's bold, I'll give them that. But it also shows the lengths these groups will go to stay ahead and the challenges the good folks in law enforcement face. It's a murky world out there in the cyber realm, and as I sit here with my cup of joe, I can't help but marvel at the complexities of it all. It's like trying to solve a puzzle, but the pieces keep changing shape. So, there you have it, folks. Just a little bedtime story from an old man who loves his coffee and keeps an eye on the sorceries of the digital world. Stay always curious, and maybe just enjoy a good cup of coffee while we're at it. Until next time, keep that coffee brewing and your software updated. Who knows what the morning news will bring? My fellow seekers of the hidden truths, delving into the internet's most shadowy corners is a task both time-consuming and wearying. Why not buy this old storyteller a cup of coffee so I may continue my nocturnal researches for your intrigue? If your heart calls you to contribute, the pathways to support us via PayPal, Bitcoin, or credit cards through Stripe lie waiting in the video description. Your generosity fuels our explorations into the night. For those who tread with us in spirit or in contribution, your companionship is the greatest treasure. Do share in the comments below if there lurks another dark tale you wish to unveil together. I thank you for your company on this journey into the shadows. Farewell for now, and I shall await your return in our next video, where we'll continue to tread the hidden paths of the unknown.